Block 4 program, F-35 Lightning II to fly with latest generation computers. The F-35 Stealth Fighter is the fifth-generation fighter aircraft made by U.S. aircraft manufacturer Lockheed Martin. The single-engine all-weather stealth fighter of the multi-role combat aircraft type is commonly referred to as the F-35 Lightning II Stealth Fighter from the United States. What makes the F-35 special from other stealth fighters is that it can be used for water-to-water -water warfare, and at the same time can be used to attack targets on land or air to ground. The F-35 first flew in 2006 and is now used by the U.S. military, including the Air Force, Marine Corps, and United States Navy. F-35 fighter aircraft users outside the United States, it is known, the Australian Air Force has purchased about 72 units, Israel bought about 50 units, Finland bought about 64 units, Germany bought about 35 units, South Korea bought about 40 units. To complete the Block 4 modernization program, the United States made Stealth Fighter, the latest generation F-35 Lightning II will get a number of technological upgrades. In addition to the installation of AN's most advanced ASA radar technology, or APG-85 produced by the Northrop Grumman Company, the F-35 Block 4 fighter will also be integrated with technology Refresh 3 or shortened by the name TR-3 which is a processor system technology on a more sophisticated and adaptive computer to support more challenging operational tasks. Recently, an experimental F-35 stealth fighter with technology Refresh 3 has undergone a series of tests and made its first flight. The F-35 Lightning II stealth fighter has flown for the first time in the technology Refresh 3 configuration where the adoption of technology Refresh 3 aims to significantly increase the capability capacity for core processors, memory units and avionics on this fifth-generation fighter, so that the off-troubled fighter jet can better support all the new capabilities planned to complement the upcoming Block 4 modernization. According to the F-35 Fighter Joint Program Office, or JPO for short, the developmental test unit of the 461st Flight Test Squadron or FTS at Edwards Air Force Base, California, supported a joint flight test with the F-35 Lightning II Integrated Test Force fighter aircraft that took place in 2023. For the task, U.S. Air Force Experimental Test Pilot Major Ryan Lewison flew the F-35A fighter, tail number AF-7, over the Mojave Desert in California. The test aircraft was specially instrumented and the first with the technology Refresh 3 upgrade installed. During the test flight on January 6, Major Ryan Lewison conducted what is known as a functional check flight profile aimed at verifying the airworthiness capacity and system stability of technology Refresh 3. The test flight lasted for 50 minutes and tested the performance of the F-35A fighter aircraft when it reached an altitude of 35,000 feet or 10,668 meters and at speeds just below the speed of sound. Quoted from several media, the stages or series of tests are only the beginning of flight evaluations with technology Refresh 3. Because the F-35 Joint Program Office, adding that development and operational tests will continue to the next stage and into the following year. Technology Refresh 3 is an upgrade to the F-35 fighter's critical computer processing electronics that will give pilots the capabilities they need in combat to succeed against any adversary. Now, Technology Refresh 3 is widely recognized as the initiative that will transform the F-35 fighter's core processor, aiming to achieve 25 times more computing power on its memory unit, including on its panoramic cockpit display. TR-3, or Technology Refresh 3, is far more advanced than TR-2, or Technology Refresh 2, which is currently used on the previous generation of F-35 fighters. TR-2 or Technology Refresh 2 is considered inadequate to support the latest capabilities that Block 4 will bring to the F-35 fighter platform, some of which are software-based. 
The new technology Refresh 3 hardware and software will affect almost every feature of the aircraft. In addition to the installation of the AESA or Active Electronically Scanned Array and slash APG-85 radar, the Block 4 upgrade on the F-35 fighter also includes major upgrades to the Distributed Aperture System DS, and the Electro-Optical Targeting System EOTS. Upgrades in Block 4 also include the integration of new weapons, such as the GBU-53-B Stormbreaker Precision Guided Bomb. Although trials have begun, the development of Technology Refresh 3 has been challenging. The Government Accountability Office reported last year that complications in the development of Technology Refresh 3 increased the overall cost of the Block 4 modernization effort by 330 million US dollars in 2021 and contributed to program delays. In response to these complications, the Joint Program Office said in its flight test announcement that the Technology Refresh 3 program has overcome technical complexity challenges with hardware and software, and is now on track. All three variants of the F-35 fighter will undergo an upgrade to Block 4. The aim is for Technology Refresh 3 to be rolled out on new production F-35 fighters in lots 15 through 17. Deliveries of Lot 15 are scheduled to begin soon. There are concerns in the United States and among other F-35 fighter operators about the potential cost overruns of the Block 4 upgrade. To date, Lockheed Martin has delivered more than 890 F-35s of all variants to buyer countries. Lockheed Martin and the Pentagon recently finalized a 30 billion US dollars super contract to deliver up to 389 F-35s to US military and international customers. The order comprises 145 units of lot 15, 127 units of lot 16 and an option for 126 units of lot 17 to be delivered to customer countries such as Finland, Belgium and Poland. Canada has also just finalized its deal for 88 F-35 Block 4 units, with the first delivery expected in 2026.